Welcome to the Taxman Show. We ask the questions to get all of your accounting, tax, and small business questions answered. Now here is your host, Albert Taxman Corey. Good morning, everybody. Merry Christmas Eve. I guess tomorrow's almost Christmas Eve, so I don't know if I'll come on. Uh, this, my name's Albert Corey, aka the Taxman, where every day we come on and we show you the simple systems and tricks to grow your small business um, with small, easy marketing tips you could implement now and saving money on your accounting to increase your bottom line. Well, today, when I was at the Dolphin game um, yesterday, Miami Dolphins, Miami fan, live in Miami, um, I realized that after watching a game, after halftime, you always got to figure where, how far you've come and where you're going to go. Let me give you a little backstory. So at the Dolphin game yesterday, um, they did a little um, tribute to the 1972 Dolphins. Um, I remember going to all those games. I was 12 years old. You know, and then as I started to realize it, you know, I started figuring how far I came. You know, I was the guy um, who barely got out of high school. Funny thing was, is one of my friends I met said, do you know your grammar is bad? I go, yeah. I mean, I just don't know because I didn't have the best high school. I didn't have the best education. You know, I didn't really have, you know, I have the best parents. Um, not, not No friends, the best parents, but they were from Lebanon. So they didn't know that English mattered. You know, grammar mattered and English matters and every in school matters. As long as I came home with good grades, um, and no, take that back, as long as I didn't get called in from the principal's office, you know, I was okay. Now, sure, I graduated high school. You know, I got A's. How did I get A's? Because I never got into trouble. Well, that could be another story. Mr. Dolores, one of my customers, 20-year customer, um, coming on board. What's up, darling? She's been with me for over 20 years, who just came on. But guess what? I realized at the Dolphin game how far I came, you know. This is the kid who got out of, like I said, out of high school. And now today, guess what? I've traveled the world, you know. Um, you know, this year I went to Mexico. Um, pretty cool. And I went to Cancun with a bunch of friends of mine from the speaking tour. But guess what? I went, I've been around the world, you know. I've been around the world, like, a bunch of times. And I'm speaking on all these cool stages. Whoever thought the kid from Miami Springs Senior High School, okay, back in 1978, who's picked on, bullied on, was on seven stages this year. Pretty cool, huh? And next year, on schedule to be 12. You know, I'll be on 12 stages next year without in the U.S. You know, U.S. and plus where it all happens along the journey. I'm somewhere in the back here. Let me get it here. I wrote a book. You know, my book, The Perception, you know, which is kind of the biggest, when I say joke, and joke in a sense that, there again, that I was the guy who said, oh, you can't be done, your writing's bad, your grammar sucks, but I got it done. How? I don't know how. I think how you get it done, everything you get done is very easy. Not easy. Is You start going around the right people. You know, for about the last four years, and, and by the way, I want to thank all this super growth thanks to Mike Evans. Because let me tell you the quick story. I mean, he helped me do email marketing, but he kind of like ripped me off. And because he ripped me off and I wanted to take it to the next level, I went to an event, a Bugs Free Mind, where I met cool people. And one thing led to another, led to another, and to another. And today I'm on world stages and met some awesome, awesome people that I would never have met. You know, like my, my boy Daniel, um, you know, my boy Daniel, um, Daniel out of Ocala, um, Zane and Angel and and her husband, Jay and, you know, um, Zan and Tom and Michelle and Gina and Mary Jo and all these cool people, you know, but I would have never thought I'd be seeing this or doing this. Bottom line is, guys, where did you go? And I'll take it back. In 2019, I never had any dreamed. You know, you don't know where you're going to go. In 2019, you know, I never thought I'd have a book written. You know, I failed twice. Another thing is perception. I, you know, perception and persistence. 
You know, two people already screwed me to write a book, but somehow I found that right person. Got the book written. Um, I went to I went to an event. Guess what? After meeting the event, I met Bill. And after meeting Bill, I, he had faith and goes, oh, you know, you got a good story. You know, typical, if you ever know Bill, he gives you so much powerful and great vibes. That, oh, you, you got an awesome story. Come to speaker camp. Come to speaker camp. Whoever thought I'd be going to speaker camp in Chicago and meeting these cool people. So that's the part of, the point of today's podcast, which you'll be turning to podcast, is where did you go last year and how are you going to take it farther? You know, how far? So whenever you feel bad in life, okay, think about where you came and where you're going. I'm going next year. You know, I'm going next year on all those tours. And I'm by the, my next goal is to be speaking. I mean, now I speak in front of a hundred people. But when I was at the Austin event, I met this guy, Ryan. And he's a bigger, he's a big time promoter. And he puts on events for 600 people. And last week, um, I met um, a cool guy, um, Ray Perez, Brandon Two Days, awesome guy. And after working with these people together, you know, I realized um, after working with Ray that I'll be able to go on these stages for six, eight hundred, where Ryan will be saying, hey, Albert, come on, we need you. Because I got the coolest skills. You know, I know how to build businesses without spending any money. You know, people have been around me for a long time, like Dolores will tell you <laughs> how I started my office. And, you know, um, on 68th Street uh, in January, we'll be starting 36, 35 years, maybe. We started in 80, I mean, sorry, in 85, 35, I don't know, 35 years. But we started with, not, you know, with nothing, going in and out of houses, you know, working out of my mom, mom's bedroom. You know, you can see my whole presentation at albert, A-L-B-R-T-C 360.com. Pretty cool. And and then, you know, that I'm now there. You know, I mean, it's like so crazy how I went on this journey, how you need to get on a journey. You know, um, you know, you need to shut off. Another thing I was listening yesterday, I was listening to Jim Rohn, and it was so cool. It was so cool, he says... You know what's costing everybody the most money to be successful, whether it's losing weight? It's shut off Netflix. Shut off Netflix. <laughs> another new the, another new, new time stealer is Disney Plus. Could also steal it to you. Difference is, though, is if you're going to go on Disney Plus, um, go watch the Imagineering shows, which showed me this building of Disney. Awesome, awesome, um, pretty cool stuff. To see how Disney built, and there's a whole bunch of business lessons on on on, Inst on Instagram on Netflix. There's also some cool shows that I learned a lot from last year. It's Insta House, something. It's like an Airbnb, how to build. So even on these platforms to go watch, you know, this TV or whatever. There's plenty of things to go learn. Like on on YouTube, YouTube. There's plenty of things to go learn. Go take yourself to the next level. So my goal for 2020 is to take everything to the next level, to amp it up. Um, come on, my cool, co hi Susie. A couple of my cool things um, for next year um, is I want to get my online university built, which we're working on. Um, speak in front of bigger people. You know, and by the way, if anybody wants to come on and be on my podcast, um, I always got time to put podcast. Uh, all you got to do is go to Albert, Albert, A-L-B-E-R-T-C 360.com. Um, and you'll see how to get a hold of me, how to set an appointment. Well, that's it for today, guys. You know, um, I've been on the road for <laughs> for the last quarter and I got a lot of returns I got to get done and bookkeeping projects and coaching that I have to gun to end of the year strong. So final thoughts is, I want you to write down where you want to go next year for 2020 and start working your game plan to get there. All right. Remember, sharing is caring. Um, you can follow me. I even got everything even cooler. You can go to Albert, A-L-B-E-R-T-C 360, and you can see all my platforms. We'll now be also coaching that out where on that website, you can get my book. You can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Follow me everywhere in the universe 
at Albert C360. And also, like I always say, remember, sharing is caring. We're on all platforms. So I'll talk to everybody. Probably, I might listen, I'll probably end up doing another one. But for now, Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. And let's go rock it next year. Bye. Thank you for listening to The Taxman Show. If you have any questions, please leave it below or email it to albert at 1040w2.com. Remember, sharing is caring. Please follow us on all social media platforms.